Okay, today I'm going to show you how to remove the graphics card bracket for the Dell Precision T3500. So the first thing you do is you get this latch right here. I don't know if you can see it or not. This latch, just pinch it in and then move this up to release it. The next thing you do is you get this, get a small Phillips head screwdriver like this. And there are two screws on each side, one, one here and the other one back there. So just unscrew it. Okay, that's the first screw. And the next screw is right there. Get a second screw. And to get this thing out, um, Put some pressure this way, this direction. Let's try this way. Let's try the other way again. <laughs> Hard to do on camera. Let me go to the other side. Okay, I'm pushing this way. I'm holding this here. I'm pushing it that way. And then I took it out. See that? There's like a little indent right there, which latches onto that. And on this side, there's an indent right there, which latches onto this right here. So that's how you get it out. So if you want to put it back in, you do the same thing. You push, put pressure this way and get it into the indent. I got the first one in. And then over here, you push this way and then get it into the second indent. Pressure this way to get this in, okay. Pressure that way to get that in, this way. Okay, 
now it's in. I'm gonna screw it back in. So I'm gonna put this screw in there. Uh, this is useful when you want to add a bigger graphics card into the Dell Precision T3500. Because sometimes this bracket blocks the video card. The video card is higher than this bracket and it doesn't fit. So then it's going to be like this. So then you can't close the case. That's one of the problems with having this thing here. You could remove it any time if you want to without breaking it. And the second screw in here, just screw it in if you want to put it back on. Don't put it on, don't screw it in too tightly, just, just make sure it's firm, it's just in there firmly. And then just close this thing back on. And that's it. And there's another problem with the uh, graphics cards it's with this computer model. That being that, um, that being, if the graphics card is too high, you're not going to be able to close this thing. It's going to obstruct it it's it so then it's not going to close completely then you can't shut the case again so the graphics card if you want to get a large graphics card it's got to be flush so it it could fit into the case and without uh so that you'll be able to close the case you know with the lid with the side lid Okay, thanks for watching.